you may have seen her uh, on the cover of Sports Illustrated Swimsuit Edition, not a big deal. Yep. Uh, Camille Kostek in the house for this edition of Stanley Cup Live. She's rocking Bruins What's here. Up? Welcome to the Good. show. Thank you for coming on. We are pumped to have you. Uh, how jacked up are you for game two here? I mean, we're, we're in the home of the champions over here. So oh, I mean, I, I, can say, <laughs> I can say that I um, just got off of the duck boat tour. Um, coming home with the Lombardi trophy was really super exciting. So I'm really hoping that I can be in the crowd this time enjoying uh, the Stanley Cup going for a ride. I said this yesterday when we were here, but you New England people are such spoiled, not brats, but you're very spoiled. You dominate <laughs> football. You domi you're about to dominate hockey. You dominate baseball. Now you dominate the cover of the Sports Illustrated Swimsuit Edition. Oh my edition. gosh, that uh, is this, a pretty cool it edition. It doesn't get boring for you guys, does it? <laughs> I mean, I will say, when I got covered, that was something, that was like a 12 year long dream. This is a 12 year long dream lived out for me right now. That was something I worked a really, really long time for. But I think one of the coolest parts about it was I could not wait to bring it home to New England. Like, I could not wait to get back on the scene. This is my first time since the cover came out two weeks ago that I am back in Boston. So oh, it's really cool awesome. to get to see everybody, you know, shake hands, give high five, give hugs. And, and it's such an exciting time here. So how did that happen? Fun. How did you become such a big fan of hockey? My, so my younger brother and sister both played hockey. So I spent okay. a lot of time, a lot of weekends um, going around and, you know, root my brother on. He actually was best known player for getting a couple of hat tricks. Um, so I, um, he played right wing. I was a big fan. And yeah, I love putting on the beanie, even though it's summertime, <laughs> and, and getting ready it's to suit cold up for out a there today, though, ice actually. Do you, so have I know. Do you have a favorite player? There's some Bruins well, you from your hometown, what? right? Well, I was saying, uh, being a Connecticut native, um, actually, my sister's in the crowd here. She's also from Quinnipiac. So we're big fans of Clifton. Connecticut is rooting for him. You know, yeah. big goal uh, the other night for the game. And. Um, yeah, we're rooting him on from CT. It's a crazy <laughs> crowd. I got to get your opinion on, like, what are you like watching a hockey game? Like, what kind of a, are you loud? Do oh, you I'm get loud. up? Do you I'm cheer? Loud. Like, what is Camille like watching I, hockey? I get worked up. So, I mean, <laughs> I live for these electric environments, though. I mean, I, I love it. I love being, I used to be on the sideline of, uh, Gillette Stadium, so I love being in the crowd too now. I can't help but dance, I can't get help but get up and scream and get everybody amped up and rowdy. And you know, even when we're down, I've got those positive vibes going on. So I'm a rowdy, loud fan. <laughs> I so, love it. And when you win the cup, as you know, you get a day with the Stanley Cup. And Mike Bolt's here, who takes the cup everywhere. So <laughs> all you got to do is tell him where you want it and the day is yours. What would you do with your day with the Stanley Cup? Your family's here, wow. I know. So what do you think you'd do? I mean, we already took a family picture. It's one of those things like pictures or it didn't happen. I mean, the line was, people were lining up to take pictures. <laughs> what would I do with it? I don't know, man. I feel like Anywhere I kind of just go? did like, it. Well, you know what? Would, would a lot of people, because of the bowl at the top, like eat out of it? Like, what would you want to oh. eat out of the Stanley Cup? Okay, if I had to eat something out of the Stanley Cup, I would definitely, I, my, I know some of my fans have tuned in. I am a cotton candy <laughs> oh. lover. So I would, that would be like my little bowl of cotton candy. Oh, Make nice. a little cotton candy maker for a day and um, let people, other people enjoy it too. <laughs> I don't know if I've seen cotton candy in the Stanley Cup. Have you? Think, like, cereal, There's a first pasta, for everything. Cotton candy. I'm going to have to do a day with the Stanley Cup.